Hello everyone and welcome to my Sister Wives YouTube channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribers button and give this video a thumbs up. The Sister Wives season 18 cast members have been disclosing some shocking information this week on their personal lives and relationships. Sister Wives' violent conflicts, resentment, and crushed dreams in season 18 have shown a shady side. Although the Brown family is technically still alive, their pulse is feeble. Because Christine Brown abandoned him, Cody Brown is upset. Favoring Robin Brown, however, paved the way for her departure. Mary Brown is set to follow in the footsteps of Janelle Brown, who has had enough too. Yelling, swearing, and injured sentiments are the main causes of the gloomy atmosphere. There once was a unified family unit. Together, the kids and their parents would go sledding or carve pumpkins. Now that those glorious times are gone, all is ashes. The topic of Sister Wives Season 18 is unhappiness. Cody is constantly being insulted by the unhappy women in his life, which ruffles his feathers. When he wasn't holding her hostage during the COVID-19 pandemic, Janelle believes that he abandoned her financially. Christine is upset with him for treating Janelle badly. She hopes that Janelle will relocate to Utah so that they may continue to be close. It's like trying to find a needle in a haystack, but Mary is hunting for some indication that Cody is concerned. With Robin, Cody is merely a gentleman. He's more of a beast with the other women. With the exception of Christine, who recently got married, all of Janelle, Mary, and Christine are living single lives off-screen because he isn't attracted to any of them. This season has seen an all-time high for his impolite behavior, so it should come as no surprise that when he eventually admitted to Mary that he was no longer into it, it hurt her deeply. According to E! News, he made this revelation in an exclusive teaser video for the next episode. Although their legal marriage was the beginning of their spiritual partnership, which was intended to be a eternal covenant, things are changing. At 52 years old, reality TV star Cody is prepared for a new way of life. He finds more tranquility in his connection with Robin than in the high-pitched drama that comes with being polygamous. Mary felt a twinge of pride at this incredibly unpleasant proposition. She has been obedient for far too long. She responded, Why would I want to do that eternally? She felt like a light bulb gone on, and she could see the path ahead. This, self-respect was the torch that helped to illuminate the figurative darkness. Even though Cody assured her she could stick around if she so desired, she believes he changed his mind about her. Although the language used was rather light, the message was clear. Cody is tired of sugarcoating his feelings and is over many marriages. Years too late, he's finally showing his true self. His comments needed to be expressed, even though Mary must have been devastated to hear them. They were much past due. Off screen, my Kelty Padron announced her pregnancy in June of 2022 and gave birth to twin sons Ace and Archer. According to US Weekly, Christine sees her daughter's sonogram pictures for the first time, revealing that she is carrying twins in a behind the scenes look at today's Sister Wives episode. The family is having a happy and thrilling moment, which is fortunately caught on camera. My Kelty recently shared a cute Instagram photo of her sons playing in a pumpkin patch. After around a year of birth, they are starting to get huge. Their red hair goes well with the fall foliage. My Kelty is the second oldest of Cody and Christine's six children. Tony Padron, her spouse. Avalon, their other daughter, is older than the twins. Her birth month is April 2021. Though it's obvious that the Padrons are busy, sometimes the turmoil must be so much joy. Christine Brown was all smiles when she discussed a first Wise Club meme on her stories. She found the above-mentioned meme to be hilarious. Diane Keaton, Bette Midler, and Goldie Hawn are among the film's cast members included in it. 
But someone had tattooed the faces of the sister wives' ex spouses on those famous Hollywood actresses' bodies. It had a funny and appropriate effect. Cody emotionally departed centuries ago, even though Christine eventually left him. He did this because Robin had captured his heart. The movie slogan is parodied in the following meme, which reads Don't get mad, get real. It speaks a lot that Christine is able to laugh about her breakup with Cody. She is such a different person now. She's never been happier since she married David Woolley. She has everything she needs and her children. Christine is also famous from reality. Off screen, Cody is getting used to living without Mary, Janelle, and Christine. Although he makes feeble attempts to keep his ties with Janelle and Mary intact, Janelle is fleeing the scene. The ex-partners are familiar with the routine, having seen Cody's behavior over the years. They had seen him and formed their own opinions. They're less likely to put up with his bullshit now that they know him so well. They are changing because they know he won't. It is crucial to have the ability to adapt. It varies from person to person. Off-screen, despite having driven his wives away, Cody is furious. He still has Robin but he spends all of his time thinking about the past rather than trying to make her happy. He uses every opportunity to cause trouble. Is there a void in his life that these kinds of pointless pursuits are meant to fill? Perhaps he isn't really as happy as he and Robin make out. They've experienced instability this season, but maybe they'll remain together. Not a single brown woman is truly happy in Sister Wives season 18 but Christine will get there eventually. Wives of sisters prior to her marriage to David Woolley, Christine Brown made a significant career choice. What is the ex-wife of Cody Brown doing these days to make money? Before getting married to David Woolley, sister wives actress Christine Brown made a significant career decision. Here's what Cody Brown's ex-wife is doing to make money in 2023. When Christine, 51, made the decision to break up with Cody in November 2021, she began to make several adjustments in her life. On March 25, 1994, Christine wed Cody for the third time. Together, they had six children together. Son Payton and daughters Aspen, Michelty, Gwendolyn, Isabel, and Truly. Christine worked for LuLaRoe, a multi-level marketing organization that sold clothes to women in order to gain money. The business faced criticism following a lawsuit alleging it was operating an unlawful pyramid scheme. Christine held the position of top-level seller on Lularo. But after Christine met her new husband, everything changed. A significant employment decision was made by Christine a few months prior to her ideal wedding. Supporters speculated that it might be because David has owned a drywall company for more than 20 years and appears to produce a solid living for his family. On May 15, 2020, Christine registered the limited liability company, Crown Quest LC. The U.S. Sun claims that it is an authorized business. According to Internet Records, it was introduced with the Arizona Corporation Commission. Domestic LLC was the entity type that was specified. According to the business description, it's for any legal purpose. The location of the business was the house that Christine and Cody once shared in Flagstaff, Arizona. The location of Christine's business may have changed after she relocated to Salt Lake City, Utah. Christine announced on Facebook Live in May 2023 that she would no longer be selling Lularo merchandise. According to the U.S. Sun, Christine stated, I just don't have time for it like I did before, and I don't want to be spread too thin, and I think I'm just being spread too thin. Christine stated that rather than selling clothing, she would want to concentrate on her love of cooking. Christine Padron sent her daughter Michelty Padron her Lularo goods. Christine did concede, though, that she would keep shopping at Lularo. Plexus simply seems like it would fit better with my current path. Christine continued, I just want to make people feel better. Christine left an MLM company, but she isn't leaving Plexus just yet. Christine's current weight loss effort is linked to her engagement with Plexus. 
she has been working out every day and hopes to lose 20 more pounds. Christine frequently advertises a pink drink from the company in her Instagram photos. Supporters of Sister Wives have questioned the product safety. Christine doesn't leave nasty comments on these kinds of blogs in order to avoid criticism from Sister Wives fans. Christine also charges $55 for a private video on her Cameo account. Christine is improving the level of interaction amongst her followers on social media in the meantime. Now that she is not selling leggings, she will also be starting a book club and offering crochet lessons, which may help her make extra money. Thanks for watching if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and don't miss any updates.